This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. I didn't do anything. Exactly what Sarah says every time I catch her in a lie. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there, <clears throat> she would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. She needs to grow up sometime. You do not know what she needs! Hmm. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else. That your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure, you are not to be trusted. Stay away from my daughter. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. It doesn't bother me. I can live with it. Wow. Nice. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. We've all had bad experiences. Nick lost his mom. We took care of him. É, gente. Vamos estar tenso aqui no The Walking Dead. Estamos aqui fazendo a segunda temporada. We thought we could control it. Você está com o DG, eu sou. And then she turned. And his mom was right there. DG, você está aqui no canal Dre Games. There was nothing we could do about it. Anyway. Vamos aí. Hopefully you understand. Thiago Games, Thiago Games está aqui acompanhando a gente aqui, ó. É... Temáticos também. Thiago Games 007. Mais um aí te temáticos. Cadê o so, Good of War? Gente, o Good of War. Eu só Good of War vai ser só na segunda-feira, tá bom? I don't know. Felizmente aí, porque eu já tava tudo combinadinho aí, a gente vai fazer aqui toda segunda-feira aqui uma sessão completa de Good of War, tá bom pra vocês? E a pedido de alguns, e a pedido aí veio aí pra me fazer o The Walking Dead. Só que eles pediram pra fazer o The Walking Dead a segunda parte. Tá? Bom, obrigado aí para estar tá acompanhando a gente aí. Hey, 
I'm sorry. I I shouldn't have asked. Hmm? My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them. But they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? I ran away. I was stupid. There was a man who said he knew my parents. I thought I knew what I was doing, but I ran away. And Lee died because of it. Maybe he would have died anyways. It was my fault. I just... Sometimes people die because of me. Nossa. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. Couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mm, wouldn't that be nice? Oh, you're still here. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Whose baby is it? Excuse me? If it's not Alvin's, whose is it? You shut your fucking mouth! Don't talk to me like that. Oh, what? You can't pull some shit on me. I'm not my husband. You should watch your language if you're going to be a you mom. You should watch your ass if you know what's good for you. Hmm. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. You got what you came here for. Now go. O negócio tá sinistro. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. She's all talk. She doesn't scare me. She was in a mood last night, that's for sure. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. My friend Lee taught me. That's good. It's important nowadays. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey, why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. 
boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. Let's just get to the river. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. Hum, nervosinho. Estressado, menino, hein? So anyway, I found that buck later that season. <coughs> Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Oi? Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Nossa. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissing match. What was it then? Mm. Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now. Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself. Nick's right. This doesn't look good. No, it don't. One of these folks might still be alive, and they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just keep your head on straight. <laughs> Same deal. We shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Hey, tá um negócio tá tenso aqui. Um dead night. <coughs> Deixa eu ver aqui. É, temáticos depois você traz uma gameplay de Dead Nights ou Resident. 
Cara, só vocês escolherem qual que é residente que vocês querem. Do... Do 1 ao 6 aí eu posso trazer qualquer um pra vocês aí. Vocês deixam o um comentário aí que eu faço uma gameplay da hora pra vocês. Infelizmente o meu computador não roda o 7, cara. A minha placa de vídeo ela é muito fraca. Mas... Eu vou fazer o possível aí pra trazer uma gameplay aí. Eu posso trazer o 0, o 1... Os dois antigos... O 3 também eu consigo trazer. O 4... O 5 e o 6 Qualquer um desses aí, ó Vocês deixa aí O The Night, eu não sei Eu não sei se vai rodar Mas eu posso dar uma olhada Tá bom? Se vocês quiserem, eu faço o Resident 2, como ele é bem curtinho, dá pra mim pegar ele do começo ao fim e fazer as duas histórias de uma vez só, uma live de uma vez só. A mochila dela... Krista, the woman I was with, what happened to her? Please, tell me, tell me. <coughs> Please. Com tudo ainda, a bichinha tem o coração bom. Ah! Pete! I'm fine! I'm fine! Just... Just lost my footing! Damn it! God damn it! Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Eita! Ainda, vamos lá. Well, they shouldn't be able to get through that. On the downside, we can't get through them. Staring ain't polite. Come on out and say it. What are you going to do? Hand me that there.
It's worth a shot, I guess. I got nothing to lose, other than my Piggly Wigglies, of course. Ugh, bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just... Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Oh, Nick. That stupid kid. It's empty. <coughs> Damn. I'll keep looking around. Tá, a gente tá sem sorte, hein? What's in there? Anything we can use? Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now. Got a light? Gente, cigarro faz mal para a saúde, viu? Só para informar. Oi? Well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? We wait. O que ela vai fazer quando esse cara se transformar dentro dessa van, velho? Something funny? I've been thinking. And I don't want to die. <coughs> I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. 
Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels like... Like a rope was wrapped around my neck. I'm getting tighter every second. It feels like I can't... <coughs> can't breathe. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I can't make any promises. He might be... Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. Where are you going? <laughs> I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? <coughs> Wait for my signal. <coughs> Straight to Desculpa the woods. Aí, eu não tô virando zumbi, viu? Keep moving. All right. <risos> Let's get this over with. Ai, não deu tempo, cara. Nossa, o que tá acontecendo? Eu não tô entendendo que tá acontecendo com esse controle. Da outra vez fez a mesma coisa, não deu tempo. Vamos lá, vamos lá, tentar de novo. Wait for my signal. And run straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. <risos> Bora lá. Let's get this over with. Um controle, não me decepciona não, cara. A Clementar vai morrer de novo. É, o negócio foi tenso, hein. Episódio 2 Uma casa dividida Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. É, Clementine, ficou com a resposta, hein? Say cheese. 
I found this under the house. <coughs> There's all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Please? Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Clem, you're scaring me. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Just need to. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! É, gente, o negócio tá mu... Olha lá, olha. That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Fine, thank you. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? Would you please leave? This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. We have a big group. Lots. Oh? How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish hmm. guy and his daughter. Cara tá caçando, hein? Bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Então o cara tá achando que a Carmentine é boba. Olha lá, vai vendo.
Well, looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to ten people with you? More. Hmm. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Been here for a year. Is that right? It's dangerous to stay put that long. Surprise you've lasted. I've been lucky. I doubt that. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug, son of a bitch. But a smart man. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite <laughs> for a girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. <clears throat> this is my house. Fair point. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Well, it's a kid. Yeah. Looks like it was taken in this room. You have no idea who these people are, do you? Do you know them? Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Well, they... Locked me up in a shed. If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. Hey, <laughs> 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 sinistro. Why shouldn't I trust them? You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. What was I supposed to do? He had a gun. I told you not to open the door for anyone. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Yeah, but I think he was lying. What? I thought he said his name was George. 
George? Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know. Kind of deep and scratchy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Uh, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Or not nice. Right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. É, tá say anything to hurt us. Ah, what do you think? Você está assistindo The Walking Dead. Eu sou o DG e você está no canal Dree Games. A picture? Olá. What were you doing taking pictures? Vamos lá, gente, se inscreva aí no canal. Deixe seu like. You need to calm down. Alright, you're scaring your daughter. It was Sarah's idea. I don't care whose idea it was. He was scouting. Eita. We got lucky. Fiz he wasn't errado. expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Where are we going? Anywhere but here. Into the mountains, maybe. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Hmm. Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Now you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. I know you did your best back there. It's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Eita. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? Ixi, a charavan, ó. There. That's where we were. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Yes. Nossa, velho. Oh, my God. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. 
Nick, he, he, he's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He was scared and... Scared? My uncle? He got bit. Back... back in the stream. Fuck you! No way! Nick. Come on, man. Fuck off! Oh, yeah, boca! I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. I have to look for Krista. She was headed north, right? Yeah. So are we. Look, you're going to have a better chance of finding her with us than on your own. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay. Nossa, cinco dias andando, pensa. That's our only choice. Anda bem, hein? Cinco dias depois. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. We've got to find some shelter. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Here, eat this back. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, <laughs> but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. 
It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. I know what that's like. Yeah. Shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I've got the big one. Hey, kid. Look, it's not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? Maybe I am. Just stick with the plan, okay? Nossa, ela já sacou o martelo do bolso de trás da camisa, da calça. Vamos lá. Go ahead. Give us a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Nice work, kid. Tá que menina mais bruta. <laughs> Olha lá, funcionou agora. Aê, Clementine, você é a nossa heroína do dia. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. Com muito sacrifício, errei várias vezes, mas estamos aí, vamos continuando. You see him? 
Yeah. Just play it cool. <laughs>